and they're off. Pretty even beginning. Incitatus breaks near the top. Osigano is there. Battle Creek not far behind. Ice Cap and Jingle settles in at the back early. Clubhouse turn. Incitatus steps out to lead. Osigano comes up on the outside to be second. Ice Cap settles in toward the rail, cruising along while third. Battle Creek is fourth. And Jingles at the back and fifth, angling to the outside within five lengths of the lead and three wide. The leader, no doubt about it, it's Incitatus. Incitatus steps out now to lead by three to the backstretch run. And gets an opening quarter in a controlled 24 and two. Advantage, Incitatus, clear by four with five furlongs to go. Osigano on the outside is second. Ice cap inside, none to long while third. Jingle has moved up into fourth. And with that, Battle Creek is back in fifth. Heading for the far turn, Incitatus continues to roll along up top. The opening half in 48 seconds flat picked up the pace that second quarter. They're on the far turn. Incitatus still in front, holding on to that lead by two. Osigano up into second. Ice cap third. Jingle has been wide throughout, but is launching a rally now. Coming on three wide. Battle Creeks and a full out drive at the back. Heading for the top of the stretch. Incitatus turning for home in front, but it's a narrow lead. Jingle to the attack. Osigano gives way between them. Ice cap and Battle Creek. One for long to go. Jingles in front at the eighth pole. Jingle, steady progress throughout in front by two. Incitatus back into second. Osagano third. They're coming for the finish, and from off the pace, it's Jingle. Jingle by two and a half in the end. Incitatus held second. Osagano was third. And they're off. Dazzling Dominica fires out fast. Ski slope with good speed as well. These two go one, two. And Janet is ready quickly advancing on the far outside up into third. Vicky Rose is racing fourth. Funk is fifth. Old school flash sixth by four. Casey Moe's the early trailer. Rounding the far turn, Ski Slope comes looking for the lead. And Ski Slope's in front with three furlongs to go. Dazzling Dominica's back into second. Janet is ready. Pushed along third outside. Vicky Rose, three lengths farther back and fourth as they come for the top of the stretch. Ski Slope off the turn. Dazzling Dominica trying to keep pace and come on once again. These two hook up three sixteenths out. Janet is ready's back in third. Vicky Rose advancing inside and goes outside for the final furlong. Dazzling Dazzling Dominica comes away with a two-length lead, but Vicky Rose runs up into second, trying to run down Dazzling Dominica, who's still there, and will do it. Dazzling Dominica, the one-length winner in the end. Vicky Rose was second, Janet Isretti was third, and Ski Slope was fourth. And... They're off. Malibu Marley stumbled repeatedly coming out of the gate. Jazzy Ladies off near the back. Jump into the fire. Breaks in stride and is quickly in front. Heading for the opening turn. Malibu Marley comes on to be second. Sing Song Bird is third. And at the back early is Jazzy Lady. So into the opening turn they go. And it's jump into the fire. Now prompted by Malibu Marley who moves up into second, but with that, jump into the fire, responds, and reclaims a clear-cut lead, opens up to lead by a length as they head for the backstretch run. The opening quarter, a pokey, 25 seconds flat. Jump into the fire, cruising along unopposed so far. Malibu Marley is tracking from second. Jazzy Lady stalking them third, three lengths off the lead. And Sing Song Bird is the trailer. Single file heading down the backstretch run. Jump into the fire, still the leader. Malibu Marley still second, they're four furlongs out. Jazzy Lady a little bit closer now from third. And still trailing is Sing Song Bird. Far turn run. Jump into the fires, leads down to half a length as Malibu Marley cranks up the pressure. Jazzy Lady is set down as well. Nothing yet from Sing Song Bird coming for the top of the stretch. Jump into the fire, fended off that first challenge of Malibu Marley. Jazzy Lady switches to the outside for the top of the stretch. Jump into the fire, set down for the drive, still in front. Jazzy Lady runs up into second, Malibu Marley third, one for long to go. Jump into the fire with plenty left. Keeps on going and is clear by four. Jazzy Lady and Malibu Marley chasing jump into the fire 
the Wire to Wire winner. Jazzy Lady second, Malibu Marley third. They're in the gate, and they're off. Bit of an awkward start for Malibu time. Courageously breaks alertly. Epimithium is there. Optimus Cat comes on to their outside. Of the moment, tucks in behind as they move by us for the first time. Courageously is in front. The leader with one circuit to go. Epimithium with only mild pressure. Optimus Cat tracking them on the outside while third. Of the moment toward the rail is in fourth. Tough to control early as Hawk of War in tight while fifth. Uninvited guest is sixth. Carmel Bay's in seventh. Malibu time went wide into that first turn and is settled at the back of the pack, but only about six lengths off the lead. Pretty tight pack. The opening quarter goes in 24 and one. Courageously, the leader down the backstretch. Company now, uninvited guest with a backstretch move up to engage. Courageously, Optimus Cat in between with Epimithium. Of the moment is down inside, advancing with an opening there. Hawk of War is launching a rally, but is going four wide. Malibu time is five wide. Onto the far turn, and Carmel Bay is to trailer. So they're on the far turn now. Uninvited guest going head-to-head -head with Courageously. Hawk of War comes on three wide. Steady progress there. Of the moment is set to strike while down inside. Malibu Times under a ride. Epimithium between them. Optimus Cat's tailed off. They hit the top of the stretch. And it's still courageously confronted by uninvited guest. Hawk of War is there. Of the moment needs to find a way through. Epimithium down the center. Optimus Cat one for long to go. Hawk of War strikes to lead heading for the final 16th. Uninvited guest trying to finish with that one. Of the moment and Epimithium outside. It's Hawk of War short lead. Uninvited guest. Best photo! Nose is up and down. Hawk of War or uninvited guest. Either one. Epimithium and of the moment. They're in the game. And they're off. T would not pass away well. Cindy Storm is there. Jackie's back and father and gay from the outside post. Kevlar tries to get a forward spot too. Into the first turn and T would not pass is the quickest. And Cindy Storm moves with that one, and they share the lead early on. Two lengths back to Father and Gay, a bit wide on that opening turn, racing up into third with Jackie's back right there to fourth. They're only two lengths off the lead, and they're together. A margin of four back to Kevlar, who comes away in fifth. Major Cam is sixth, Blue Bank in seventh, Keepon is eighth, and it is a long way back. At least 15 lengths back to Hickory Court, completely outrun. The opening quarter goes in 23 and 4. There's five for lungs remaining. Cindy Storm the leader, but it's a narrow lead. Tiwanot Pass is stalking intently from second. Father and Gay is wide while third. Major Cam sneaking through underneath, up to take over fourth past the half mile pole. Kevlar is three or four wide, racing up from fifth. Jackie's back is under pressure sixth. Blue Bank in seventh, five back to keep on. And still completely outrun is Hickory Court. The half mile time in 48 and 3 fifth seconds. They round the far turn. Tiwanot Pass has come away with the lead. Cindy Storm couldn't keep up. Father and Gay comes on two wide. Kevlar poised three wide by the quarter pole. Major Cam's in behind them. Top of the stretch. Tiwanot Pass set down and opens up. Kevlar putting in a run now. Kevlar's up into second. Major Cam's now third. One for long to go. And Tiwanot Pass repels the challenge of Kevlar and opens back up. It's Tiwanot pass clear by two. Kevlar second, Major Cam third, and it's that way on the wire. Tiwanot pass the winner. Two lengths in the end. Kevlar second, Major Cam third, and Father and Gay was fourth. They're in the gate. And they're off. Squeeze back a bit at the start was high fair. Yes to mischief. Hits the ground running and quickly builds a two-length lead. Sent on for speed right off the mark is she. Three lengths in front now. Ford Don takes up the chase from second. 13 stripes comes away third. Zamuda's racing fourth. A paycheck smile advancing toward the rail from fifth. Mike Corlena far outside sixth. High fair in between horses seventh. And more romance is at the back and eighth. The opening quarter goes 22 and three. Yes to mischief. Hits the far turn run in control. Leading by two and a half. 
And then it's Ford Don tracking intently from second, inching forward is that one. My Corlena comes alive with a three or four wide bid. Zamuda's holding on to third at the moment. More Romance has advanced toward the rail. And then it's High Fair at the quarter pole. Yes to Mischief confronted by Ford Don. Ford Don right up alongside of Yes to Mischief who digs in. Yes to Mischief fending off that first challenge. Still there. Ford Don set down for the drive. High Fair's closing in late. Down to the final 16th. Yes to Mischief is stubborn. Yes to Mischief and for Don. Farther out, more romance. Late on the scene with Zamuda and High Fair. But it's Yes to Mischief. A determined winner over for Don, Zamuda, and High Fair. Habitus takes the inside route off the turn into the stretch. Big Golden turning for home and set down for the drive. World Cruiser continues on. Hashtag no wonder switched outside. Rio King down the crown of the course into the final 16th. World Cruiser comes away with the lead. Rio King with a big effort outside. Hashtag no wonder between them. World Cruiser, Rio King, these two photo. Either one, Rio King or World Cruiser. And they're off. Buck Moon breaks alertly. Twilight Blue is there. Colonel's dark temper from the far outside. Buck Moon, though, for that inside post to the front for the clubhouse turn. Twilight Blue comes on to be second. Colonel's Dark Temper racing up into third. Major Fed and Mask Parade there together, fourth and fifth. Promise Keeper a little bit wide on that opening turn, three or four wide, racing from sixth. My sixth sense to the rail is seventh. A break of four back to Farmington Road in big like the trailer is Tyshawn, 10 lengths off the lead. The opening quarter goes in 23 and three. And it is Buck Moon down the back stretch showing the way. Twilight Blue shadows that one. They're 1-2. One, two. two lengths back. Colonel's Dark Temper in the clear, racing up into third. Mask Parade is tucked away fourth and toward the rail. Major fed between horses fifth. Right in the thick of it is that one. Promise Keeper continues on while wide and is four lengths off the lead far turn. My sixth sense over to the rail trying to make some progress from there. Five lengths back to Big Lake and Farmington Road. Tyshawn is still the trailer. Three furlongs from the wire. Twilight Blue continues to pester Buck Moon. They're head and head for the lead. Mask Parade is third toward the rail. Major Fed's putting in a run now. Promise Keeper's under pressure back in fifth as they hit the top of the stretch. Farmington Road cut the corner six. Top of the lane now. Twilight Blue puts a nose in front. Twilight Blue the leader with one furlong to go. Buck Moon battles on. Here comes Mask Parade now. Mask Parade is switched out trying to run down Twilight Blue. 16th to do it. Twilight Blue is still clear. Mask Parade is lifting late. These two to the wire. Twilight Blue, yes! Held on to do it. Mask Parade couldn't quite get there. Settles for a second. Buck Moon was third. Farther back either. Major Fed, Farmington Rotor, my sixth sense. They're in the gate. And they're off. Ferocity fires out fast. Linda Tumay showing some speed, too. He's a keeper, is there. Off at Cole down toward the inside, racing up on through. Fourth, third, second, and now first. Off at Cole on through to the front. He's a keeper, runs in second. Linda Tumay is third. Ferocity is fourth. Moon Mischief is racing fifth. Congrats to me is sixth. Out working in the clear seventh. Hometown hero for that outside post to the rail in eighth. Five lengths back to Better Dasher. The round of the fire turn. They whip that opening quarter 21 and four. Off foot cold joined by Linda Tumay, three wide, who's looking for the lead and grabs it with three furlongs to go. Lendit Tumay takes over. Off foot Cole's back into second. He's a keeper's going the wrong way. Ferocity finds a seam, comes on through. Outwork and has been wide. Hometown hero cut the corner off the turn angles outside with Lendit Tumay to catch. Lendit Tumay got away by five off the turn. Ferocity and hometown hero. Moon Mischief down the center. Off foot Cole outwork and everybody chasing Lendit Tumay. Lend it to me. Took it to him at the quarter pole and rambles home. Lend it to me. Wins it by seven on the wire. Hometown hero second. Ferocity was third. Tight fourth. Outworking her better dasher. Off at cold there too.